So Sustainable Farms is about integrating the environment and economics and mental health of farmers. And it's built on 20 years of work from central Victoria, right through New South Wales to South East Queensland. The ANU team bring a really good intersection between practical farming and the science. So it's connecting the two together. They're both relevant, but it's making them both work in an environmental and real context. Farmers through Landcare and Greening Australia and local land services have been involved in these kinds of investments to improve the vegetation on their farm for, for a long time. What's often missing is the monitoring and that's where Sustainable Farms comes in to provide the scientific evidence to make better decisions. So we're working with uh, the CARA team, so Dan and Tamara, on our Grassy Box Woodlands project um, that we have, which is a patches and paths project that we call it. Uh, but it's actually about having protection for those remnant vegetation and having landholders understand what makes a grassy box woodland, what are the key characteristics. If they're looking at it on their place, perhaps it's, you know, what's missing and what they can add to it. So we need long-term monitoring to really understand what's happening and make better decisions that give us better returns on investment and are more cost-effective and ecologically effective. The Sustainable Farms Dam Study is looking at how we can identify win-win solutions. So we're trying to manage farm dams to improve their wildlife value, but also really importantly, the quality of the water and subsequently livestock production values. I think the really exciting component of the farm dams work is that we're taking an everyday resource. So farm dams, they're on basically all farms. They're commonly viewed across the landscape. They've been taken for granted a little bit. That if you actually pay a bit of attention to them, you manage them slightly differently, you can achieve some really impressive results. So you can get really good vegetation, you can get really good wildlife, and you're also producing better quality water. Sustainable Farms wants to look more at the, the intersection of economics and environment, how we can make cost-effective and ecologically effective decisions, so to focus our, our decision-making so it's better, but also to start to look at how we can put together restoration initiatives to really make a difference in terms of what's happening in the landscape. Because we've got to make sure that we position farmers in ways so that they're going to be competitive internationally through good environmental credentials. The evidence and the knowledge shows that actually we can make an impact and a change. So doing nothing gets us nothing. Doing little bits all the time will get us big results in the long term.